I'd like to begin with two simple messages. The President of the Republic of South Africa, Mr. Cyril Ramaphosa, thank you for unhesitatingly according to Praveen Godan, an official state funeral. You read history correctly and appreciate the relevance of the model that PG is even in present day South Africa, and that is incorruptible and driven by the goal of a South African nation at peace with itself. To Vanida, her province comrade in arms, Anisha, Priyasha, and the extended Godan family, take solace from the outpouring of tributes from within South Africa and the international community. Take comfort from the knowledge that Praveen became larger than life because you stood by him, you suffered with him, and you gave him strength. You made it possible for him to write himself in what happened in our country and what happens in, as South Africa journeys into the future. This is an occasion to recognize some hard truths. Without the exposures by the media and the fight back mounted by Praveen and his formidable team at Treasury. PG was a brave heart and had no time for cowards. We must also not gloss over the fact that PG was provocative at times. He was also combative and he was occasionally unorthodox. And those who would engage in the debate on macroeconomics with PG would understand that sometimes PG had views that actually back against orthodox thinking. And yet he was willing to accept the views of others. It is also well known that PG was tormented by many false accusations designed to impair his dignity and distort his legacy. Comrade Mack was right, he was sometimes physically threatened and subjected to vile racist, racist, racist attack. He and the members of his families became central targets of the campaign which was so vicious, the Bell Pottinger campaign. And sometimes we, we, we need to go back to that campaign and understand what it sought to do and what remains of its impact. And I can tell you now, it sought to do a couple of things. The first was tarnish everybody who is capable of turning this country around.